everyone and happy new year this is melissa for citrus twist kits and i have the january kits all ready to unpack and share with you today we have a few new things that we're doing with the main kit especially in the new year that i am excited to tell you about and there are so many bright colors to get your year off to a great scrapping start so let me go ahead and go get these unpacked so they can show you what's going to be arriving on your doorsteps this month So I'll get things started as usual with the main kit and right off the bat um, one of the changes that I mentioned earlier is that we're no longer going to be putting one of those little Prima chalk inkers that we've had in the kits for the last 18 months or so. It was getting to the point where it was hard to choose a shade that wasn't really similar to one that we'd given you already. So instead of spending that kit balance on the ink we decided to include extra embellishments with that same money so your kit is worth um, it has the same dollar value just no more inkers and probably uh, extra embellishments or maybe extra paper every once in a while so this month you can see that there are lots of embellishments and I'll actually do those last let me go ahead and slide those to the side so that I can start off with the pattern papers now I said there were lots and lots and lots of color in the kits this month and the main kit is built around the print shop collection by Studio Calico. So you can see there's pretty much every color of the rainbow in here. So this sheet is called Hashtagged. And on the back it is a black and white kind of a offset, um, kind of a funky grid. So great for a background or if you want lots of color. From Pebbles we have from the Be Loved collection. This is one of the new collections. It was a mid-release. This is called Old Flame. It's a gray wood green on one side and an adorable pink polka dot with this one heart on the opposite. Again from Print Shop, we have And Then. This is Ampersands in orange and yellow and pink shades on one side and the opposite is a big uh, messy brush text print. From Chic Tags, this is from, let me see what this is from. This is from the Happy Place collection. It's called Crisp Air. And one side is triangles in aqua, orange, yellow, and pink. And the opposite side would make a great layout background with these watercolor, watercolor accents in the corners. From Crate Paper's Close Knit collection, we have Needle and Thread. This is hearts kind of in an embroidery pattern on one side. And the opposite is a cross stitch heart pattern on sort of a pink peach background. From Pebbles, Yours Truly, a chalkboard black background with pink arrows on one side and the reverse is pink with a tone on tone, tone on tone pink heart. This one is called Hearts. From Chic Tags, this is from the Schoolhouse Collection, a grid print on one side with these um, coffee cup stains on the corner and the side here. And the opposite is an absolutely gorgeous wood grain. And the last sheet of pattern paper is also from Print Shop. It's called Framed, so it, of course it has this chalkboard background with lots of little frames on it. And then the opposite side is Aqua Stripes in, this one says, Hello friend, you're great, and yeah, sure. Just some little text bits throughout the paper. There are also three, no, four solids, I'm sorry. A teal, the vanilla off-white, orange, and the light craft. So those are the pattern papers and solids. Let me set up a, with a little bit closer focus here so that you can see the embellishments up close. All right, the embellishments are just as colorful as those pattern papers that I just showed you. And I'll start things off with the alphabet for this month. This is uh, Thicker's alphabet from the Print Shop collection. And it's pink and you can see it has a distress pattern in it. And as usual, I've taken all the embellishments here out of the packages so that you can see them without so much glare. So there are both sheets of the alphabets, and of course you will be getting everything in the original retail packaging. From Chic Tags Happy Place, a set of eight, these are called Clips Embellishments, and what these do is they actually have a little cutout so that you can slide them over a photo or in a layer stack on top of a piece of pattern paper. So if this is random, life is wonderful, happy things, today is a good day, love 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 hello happy right here and this photograph makes me smile now those are not the only die cut elements that we have this month there's also a set of vellum die cuts from the print shop collection 
And these are really, really pretty, and I've already popped this package partway open. There are 33 pieces here, so I will not bore you by reading them all to you, but let me just get them all out and kind of quickly flip through so as you can see. Some, some chalkboard uh, journaling spots, a few little pieces that would be awesome for titles or subtitles, a little airplane, this little deer that you see repeated throughout print shop. In fact, you'll get, you're going to see some of this in the Project Life embellishment kit a little bit later on. Heart, speech bubbles, arrows. There are 33 pieces in here, so just a great variety of shapes and colors and patterns. And they're all going all over the place because they're all different sizes. I love this little camera piece. And you can see that there are some rather big ones too. That would be great for layering, using for journaling, all kinds of great stuff. So that's it for the die cut bits. There's also a chipboard sheet. This is from October Afternoon's Daily Flash Collection, which is finally starting to ship. You're going to see several pieces of this in all of the kits this month. And this is a set of clouds with raindrops in chipboard. You can see some of them have text prints, grids, and just different kinds of ledger prints. Now, to go with that cloud theme, Trina designed the wood chip for this month to be a set of clouds. And so you can see that there are three different sizes here. The largest size has hearts cut out, and you also get those hearts, some raindrops in the wood veneer shapes, and then there are the medium clouds and the tiny little bitty cute clouds. So that's your wood chip for the main kit this month. For the handcrafted vintage, remember that these are made by either Angie or Trina or a member of the design team, is a banner with a set of butterfly punch outs and they are attached on both sides so you can see from each side. Now this is a little bit of a different type of embellishment for our scrapbooking kits but thought they were really cute. These are from the Fresh Cut collection by Basic Gray and this is brand new and just started to ship in the last few weeks and these are the pom-poms and so they're they're not quite like the craft pom-poms that you get at like Michael's or the craft store they're a little bit denser but it's the same idea and they're in colors that match the fresh cut collection of course but they also work really, really well with print shops so we included them here and I'm kind of excited to see what everybody does with these the washi tape this month is an orange floral roll, and as soon as I can find the end of it, I will pull it out to show you. There we go. You can see the floral print. There's a piece of embroidery floss, a couple yards of a variegated yellow going to gold. The sequin mix this month is pink, blue, and orange. We need to come out. I'm sorry, just pink and, or blue and orange. I'm sorry, there's not pink in there. Um, in a set of cupped, kind of iridescent sequins. And I will just let those go all over the place as they normally do. And then last, the stamp set. Um, you Are My Sunshine. It's the simple things, you and me. Two ampersands, one is an outline and one is the fill. Little Darling, My Wild One, Let's Do This, Crazy For You, and Make It Happen. So that is it for the January 2014 main kit. So you'll notice as we go through this video, this month's kits have lots of alphabets in them. In fact, we even have one in the embellishment add-on, which doesn't happen all the time. So I'll start off with the 10 pins. These are from October Afternoon's Daily Flash Collection. And it says, just saying, seriously, true story, let's do this, hi, and good times. You get a set of these jawbreakers. These are like enamel dots, but slightly bigger, and they're in red and orange stripes. These are from the Candy Shop Collection by Queen and & Company. And then this set of stickers, it looks like a 6x12, actually comes packaged like this, but it folds out to a full 12x12 sheet. So you get a full alphabet on the bottom, and then a full set of icon stickers on the top, and this, this is from the Print Shop Collection. So with so much Print Shop in the main kit, it's probably no surprise to find the Print Shop 6x6 pad in the Pocket Life kit. Now, you get the full 6x6 pad as usual, and I will just flip through it quickly so that you can see all of the colors, but if you saw 
the papers from the main kit is exactly the same color scheme. You just get the whole collection's worth in here. And I love the neutrals, especially that chevron print that was back here. So take a look at the rest of those. Cute little mushrooms, florals, stars, chevrons. And that is a 36 sheet pad. Now, the Pocket Life Kit has another one of the changes that we're making for 2014, and this one has been very, very requested. We are no longer rounding the corners on the journaling cards, either on the exclusive ones that we send out or on the pattern paper and solid ones. We have had a lot of people ask us to do that. I know that not everybody likes to round the corners in their Project, project Life pages, and you can't really unround a corner once it's been rounded, so it made more sense for us just to leave them square. Now, if you do like rounded corners, you can, of course, use your own corner rounder, and we'll also have a selection of them in the shop. I think right now we have the corner rounder, uh, the corner chomper from We Are Memory Keepers, and we should be just getting in the official Becky Higgins uh, corner rounding punch that will match all of the rest of the Project Life series of cards so if you use those in addition to these kits everything will match up but if you prefer square qu corners then you can have that option as well so i'll start things off by going through the exclusive cards and we'll start off with january 2014 so happy new year everybody ampersand on a grid card every day is a new adventure this is one fantastic story once Upon a Time is one of the horizontal cards. Cherish Today, a polka dot in blue and orange and yellow. He said and she said, the best is yet to come. Today I will find the balance I seek. Some arrows on an aqua background. And today sounds so much better than someday. Now for the four by six cards, we have an orange, a craft, a yellow, a cream, and that is a sticker sheet I will get to later. So, six by six pads and journaling cards out of the way. Take a look, you also of course get a sheet of Kasha sketches for Pocket Life. Absolutely love that these are included every month. The wood veneer this month, you get two words and a bunch of geotags in two different sizes. They're small and large. So there's magic in days, and the dot for the eye is in here, so here it is, in here somewhere. And then the geotags, and for the larger geotags, the hearts are actually large enough to be usable, so we've included those as well. So you get quite a few of both sizes. Exclusive flare badge this month, 2014, here at last. The stamp set for this month is um, a series of uh, words uh, relating to dates. So we have week, day, out, night, and month. Nothing but the best, unforgettable, hello life, my week in technicolor, been there, done that, together, and then a little arrow. There are two gold doilies. There's always a lot of gold associated with New Year's, so great inclusion. The washi tape, again this month from Sticker Stop, is one of those little two yard rolls. It's just the perfect amount. And it's in an aqua geometric print. There are actually two alphabets in one this month. The Daily Flash collection, I told you you'd be seeing this throughout several of the kits. This is, actually these both come in one package. But you get two alphabets, one mini, and then the larger letters, and these are the orange, this is called Orange Soda in the shop front font. From Studio Calico, a set of accent stickers, and this looks like all one sheet, but these are really a bunch of tiny little, like, you can see how small those are, words that you can add in. So, kind of like the miniature words from My Mind's Eye, but on a much smaller scale. We have label stickers. These are actually from October Afternoon's Travel Girl, but they are not travel themed at all, except for a few of these um, look like postage cancellations, but there's nothing that says it's for travel or anything. The colors match really well with Print Shop and with this alphabet, so awesome to have label stickers back in the kit this month. And then, of course, the half sheet of labels, and these are in those Print Shop colors of aqua, yellow, and pink. 
The Pocket Life embellishment add-on this month has three items in it. I'll start off with the journaling cards. These are also from print shops, so of course you've seen lots of this this month. Two, there are four cards in here. Two of them are st stitch confetti pockets. This one has a yellow ampersand and it's kind of in a, in a hash pattern. You can see the confetti inside that. This one has that little deer that you see throughout the collection and it says, oh dear. And then you get two of these that are stitched but they're open on the top so that you can insert photos, journaling cards, memorabilia, whatever into. This one said, this life is simply amazing. And this one has a confetti print on it, but it is the same kind of open pocket design. From Pebbles, we have a set of, these are chalkboard stickers. So speech bubbles in black, and you can see they're kind of a, almost a fabric-like, uh, really heavy. So you can write on these with a white pen and get that chalkboard look. For the thickers in the Pocket Life add-on this month are this set of daiquiri foam letter stickers in pink. And you can see how well that would coordinate with Print Shop as well. So as usual, we have a pattern paper add-on this month that coordinates with the main kit. So I'll start off with the sheet that we have from Chic Tags. This is a basket weave in aqua and tan on one side. The opposite is a peach set of uh, a peach herringbone print. And this is from the Happy Place collection. It's called uh, Fuzzy Sweater. So this is kind of like a cable knit sweater design. From Print Shop, of course. That same text print that we had in black and white in the main kit, you have in pink and white on a reverse in the pattern paper add-on. This is called Her Swatches. And on the opposite, of course, it looks like paint swatches. So you have yellow fading to pink in a sort of ombre, but not a monochromatic like a traditional ombre is. Also from Print Shop, a floral in pink, aqua, and yellow and orange on one side. This is called Hello Lady, and the opposite is a yellow print with stars on it. This is from Dear Lizzie's Polka Dot Party. It's called Terrific Tunes. So one side is aqua with this mist splatter background, and the opposite is pink with a gray dot. From the Happy Place collection, again by Chic Tags, this is called Bookworm. We have orange, aqua, and gray over a grid print on one side. The opposite is text print. Um, things like happiness starts here, you are my favorite, just a lot of really upbeat, positive sentiments on the back. Going back to print shop, this is called Dear John. We have plus signs on yellow on one side, and the opposite is a letter, uh, kind of like handwriting print, on black on a white background. Another sheet of chic tags. This is also from Happy Place. It's called Happy Thoughts. So it says, life is wonderful, beautiful, lovely, and perfect because of you over wood grain on one side. And the opposite is, is sort of a reddish pink with, uh, this is a wood grain piece, and these are in a chevron pattern. One last piece, bringing in some of that orange, but from a fall collection, it's a really cool addition. This is Basic Gray's Persimmon. This one is called Butternut Squash, and on the back is navy blue with a floral and some really tiny pink dots running through it. So that is it for the pattern paper add-on. Our add-on kits are not always designed to coordinate with the main kit. Sometimes it works out that they do, and this month I think is one of those months. And I'll start off with the pattern papers again. So let me move these embellishments off to the side. These are always a little bit of a departure from the design of the main kit. And this month we have some of the brand new mid-releases in, like the Love Notes collection. This is the brand new Valentine's collection from Crate Paper that just started shipping last month. So you get the cut apart sheet on one side. This is the Book of Love. And if you don't like the cut aparts on this side, there's a whole different set on this side. So you have your choice of embellishments. Also from that same collection, another crepe paper. This one is a kind of a vanilla um, off-white background with these pink hearts on one side. This one is from Flea Market, and it's called Treasure. So this is one of the Maggie Holmes from the, um, from the summer release. Also from Flea Market, pink chevron. This one is called Market, and opposite is this text print. Now we do have one sheet from the original Maggie Holmes collection. We thought that this bokeh print went really well with the rest of the papers in here, so we added it in. 
It's called Dreamy. And the opposite is this really fun multicolor camera print. From Basic Gray's Fresh Cut Collection, again, this is one that just started shipping this month. This one is called Lilac Meadow. It has aqua sort of a wave print on this side. And the opposite is a navy blue with a watercolor effect. Now this is a bit of an older Basic Gray release, but we liked the yellow and this black and white print. This is from Knee High, so this was one of the winter releases. It's called Foursquare. So we have a yellow sort of curved herringbone on one side, and the opposite is black and white triangles. And then of course there are a couple of solid pieces in here. We have black and we have the vanilla cream sheet. So that's it for the pattern papers. Uh, let's take a look at the embellishments now. All right, for the embellishments, we have a little bit of everything, some brand new releases, some exclusives, and some things from the summer CHA release. So I'll start off with the exclusives. We have two little pieces of flair. This one says, my love, and this one is an ampersand. Two doilies. Now from the brand new releases, these are a, another set of the Daily Flash chipboard. This is called Flash Chip. It's bubble talk and of course it's speech bubbles in a lovely set of colors and patterns. Now we have two items from Maggie Holmes' Flea Market Collection. This was the summer release. I'll start off with this sticker sheet. This is a 6x12. These are the accent stickers. So you get some borders and some icons to work with and a few labels. And I don't know if it shows up really well on the camera or not, but a lot of these have gold foil print on them. They look really, really pretty in person. The alphabet this month is nice and bright. I love this blue glittered font. And this is also from Maggie Holmes Flea Market Collection. It is the doll font. And there you can see both sheets of it. So we've come to the stamp add-on. And again, it's one of these little small 2 by 3 ones. It says, what life is all about. She listened to her heart. Silver linings. Say what? Life is good. Begin now. A new day. Everyday life. 365 days of brilliant and stars can't shine without darkness and then there's a little cloud and two stars and again you can add this on to your current kit subscription or email Trina to find out about shipping for non-subscribers